Hello and welcome. I'm quite excited about this session, but I have some bad news. My rainy day fund I accidentally collected from the uh, thing. I was literally trying to grab the tractor, get in it, and I actually did the collect because I didn't realise I was that close to the Missy B in the workshop. So I'm 50 grand better off and we've collected the rainy day fund. Yes, I've tested this as in a nudge slightly on the edge and it is first grocery, so it does allow this beast on. So we've got all of the courses done. So I'm gonna get this one done on this one, this one done on that one, and then I'm gonna swap them over. And then, I know I don't do this very often, but I am gonna just pop down. I have found, I didn't realize how good the swather was. I've gotta be honest, had I realized I may well have used this lots of times before, because it does actually swath right down the middle. It is amazing. It's like a crone, but, an awful lot cheaper. It's amazing. Yeah, it just it's, it's also very much like the Vermeer. Its steering is very fantastic. Really, really amazing. So yes, this this was like I, I thought I'd just try a little tiny bit of it. And I also tried the conditioner one, which I have. I didn't realise I'd already bought that. We got it on the sales, so I've got it. It's worth about two thousand. <laughs> but I can't get it to work. No, when I do the uh, there's no button to say condition you can see the smaller one and oh, that's grass it clearly says so it's just grass so I really don't understand why that's yeah it even looks the same so it is it's not the dry color of grass so I don't know what with the conditioner bar the smaller one what you have to do to make it work there is there was no I look obviously pulled F1 help on nothing happened so it was just what it was so this is useful nine meters odd it's 9.5 i think or 9.6 so that is absolutely phenomenal it really is for 125,000. that's rolled yeah that, that rolled all the way down here it was up here i bought the the fence with that on as well i've popped across the road grabbed that and we're going to literally follow across with that and then I'm going to do this particular job. So I'm going to time lapse it, it's going to go straight into a time lapse because obviously I'm going to switch, but I, am I going to be able to do the switches seamlessly? I am, yeah. What I'm going to do is I'm going to time lapse it, but I'm going to literally time lapse it with the transitions as well where we're going from the top, the uh, two top fields to this one. Um, if, and then back again when I have to do the thing so there'll be no me talking it'll just do the transition from this this is going to be the main area of expertise I'm going to set these two going first and then we're going to pop up to the top field so yes I am going to say my words got, yeah I am I'm looking forward to this one but yeah what I was going to say was yeah there are some, always some mods that surprise you very nicely now, I got the wrong end of the stick what this was about, if I'm honest. It really is just a mower, and I didn't think it was. I thought it literally did crop. Don't ask me why I thought that, but it it's obviously is just a mower. Had I realised how good it was for the sort of price when you were thinking of buying a crone, I think we may well buy one for the bottom as well, but I don't know. if we seem. I think we've got enough down there with what we've got, but I would like this up this top end definitely I think that is well worth it and we'll just go loose as we were always planning on doing up this end also Missy B I feel a bit of a fraud now Missy B fixed the silo but not only did she fix the silo let me just show you yeah you know we we bought that 110 tons of uh <laughs> yeah we bought that 110 because we got robbed but but now it's been fixed we're back up to 217 tons, so I don't know how I'm going to fix this. Because obviously we've treated ourselves to 110 tons of uh, silage that now we're not entitled to. Obviously I didn't know we were not entitled to, but yeah, I, I don't know how to fix this. Uh, and it's a solid, so I can't destroy it in the government drain like I could if it was a liquid. At least I don't think you can, can you? I think it's only for liquid, so... Is this something I can get rid of this with? Norman, that's, can, will this allow it? No, it just, yeah, the, the white I think will disappear once we start to grab that. But yes, there's no gap down the side of this anymore. So this has been, I presume the bunker must have been, 
registered then as something bigger than it actually was but I don't know if it's going to still play nicely because of the white still being there or whether that's just going to disappear we shall see but yeah it's definitely registering back as what it was I bought the um, the lime back thing as uh, to just trace my tracks I bought one eight ton of lime only because it could go on the back of that and then of course it started to fill automatically so I actually that one's going to register as like having space because the bag isn't eight tons anymore so it was a bit of a pain I didn't, didn't realise it would do that if I had I'd have filled the back first and then put it, put it on it's a bit faffy but it's still got a lot of um, lime in obviously I've got the other one's got the fertiliser on that for some reason I left this I don't know why I've done that oh seeds that's why yeah it is true I'll use it as a seed extra didn't I so that wouldn't have been any use at all Anyway, yes. Ooh, yeah, we've got to get to. Uh, wow, 38 tons of smashing. Right, yeah, we've got a lot of work to do. I've got a 0.5 because there was all the prep. I thought, mm, is that fair? I thought, yeah, it is really. We're not working. It's literally just. And obviously, I'm chattering as well, which is a double sort of thing. So then, let's get cracking. Let's set, set these going. Yeah, I didn't realise the elevation on this. Like I said last episode, I really didn't. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Still, they should all cope with it, especially the fence. That will be oh, fine with a yeah that, that kind of elevation. Just not sure of the swather because obviously I've never used it. I'm hoping to use it quite frequently. Yes, that was what I was going to say. It is lovely. I don't know about yourselves. When you find a mod. I, I, well, I just tested it on that little bit and I was really excited straight away because I could see how good it was and the potential and all the rest of it so when you find one of those mods that you think I'm going to have that again a bit like the Unimog I mean that, that also is equally the Mercedes it is absolutely amazing and will definitely be a firm favourite like the Fent GT that I used to it was my right hand on almost all FS19 Let's Plays. I used to always have mainly as uh, mowers and as fertiliser machines, if I'm honest, because of the additional body. A bit like the Unimog, it's got 3.6 tonne storage on top of everything else. Uh, it, and by the time you've finished as well, you can still tow a trailer with some of those fertiliser spreaders or as just we've got that, got that 8 tonne additional storage with the bag now that is absolutely astronomically fantastic so yeah really is amazing anyway all that left remain to be said is my words yeah i'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side
train ready, we're popping across the road. We've got the lime fertilizer, but I just wanted to show you how much we got off that field. 245 tons of grass, which remember this can send things to other places. Yeah, I still don't know how to handle this, whether we just sell it and then deduct the money would probably be the simplest way or no because uh, yeah i was gonna say i could just deduct the money but then i've still got extra stuff so let's get these across the road anyway we shall discuss this and i am all ears to see what you uh, guys and gals say as well yeah it would be interesting to hear what yeah, i always like that when other people um have their sometimes you don't want someone to say something because you would really like it to happen another way whoa, 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 whoa. let's just yeah no, go on do you know you're a menace yes yeah it is it's uh you've got invested um investiture in what you're uh, doing so sometimes it's yeah you don't want people to say something but i gotta be honest i like fairness so i'm really if you guys and girls said something and I've oh no, why oh why are we what what is this about what you clang the gate or so oh okay well that, that's that's different <laughs> that's not really what I expected to see not really <laughs> now look menace in grey car go away you are an absolute menace now we lost the others, or are they still following? That's what I want to know. No, they're still coming. Brilliant. Yeah, I bought a bag of lime from the shop so that we could actually yeah do that. Uh, I bought quite a few things, so I would like to grab the header. Yeah, I think I figured out the um, hay. I think that's to go on the back. I've not seen any videos, but I got like a flash of insight where I thought, oh, I wonder if it's supposed to go on the back. Let's, uh, let's see if we can get this train going. I, I, oh, this is still stuck, right. Okay, I'm gonna stop this, because this is getting silly. Yeah, they're all breaking down. This, it's it's a, a nightmare, it really is. Yeah, these it is. It's whenever they pass a uh, another vehicle, they just stop. It's ridiculous. It was much better at the beginning than what Giants have done. We've done the field at least, yes. Uh, I was debating whether or not, because this is about an hour long already, and I thought, well, yeah, but I thought it's not going to take that long, he said, until the train wreck of follow me decided to uh, lose everything over there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to sort this disaster out. I'm obviously not resetting because I'm going to be losing all my lime and everything. I'm going to sort this matter out, but I'm going to sort you out off camera. So I shall see you. In a few yes, minutes, there, was, there were tractors oh, lost in lot hedges lot and all sorts, but yeah, we're sorted now. I think there are still, yeah, there's sort of still traffic on the road, which I'm not sure. Yeah, it looks like it's slowing everybody down, but I thought I'd start the cameras again rather than, yes, wait forever. Yeah, so we've got all sorts of things to do. We've got uh, headers to lift onto uh, the trailer and all sorts. That's why I brought this along. I thought, yeah, it's not working right. Although we have done that. I think it's because of the uneven... Whoa, there. Yeah. Realistic? <laughs> well, <laughs> maybe it is. Yeah. I I've been on uh, out on the roads. Yeah, sometimes Sheffield to go <laughs> in the streets of Sheffield can be a little bit like that. Only with less of the bumper action, yeah. But there's definitely a bit of slalom action goes on on uh, inner city Sheffield at times with people jumping lanes and all sorts of weird and wonderful things. So, yes, <laughs> I can definitely say, whoa, what? Why? Sorry, it's got like some sort of, it's really slow. Oh, one other thing. This is a fantastic contraption, but you can't use course by on it it doesn't understand what that bag is at the back it's twice it's locked up not enough to crash the computer but enough that you've got a tab or jump out of the vehicle if it'll let you yeah just a warning for anybody any pc or mac users yes use that a lizard 1300xl at your peril yeah you have been warned it's a little bit of a menace with course play so uh, i'm sure it'll get sorted out what I'm going to do off camera, I'm going to quickly sort out the courses. Then we're going to do this. This is the last, yeah, last couple of jobs of the day. 
Uh, no, it needs rolling. We haven't got rolling yet, have we? We're going to do this one without, but we are going to... Yeah, it's not that we have not got the money, but I don't want to add any length onto this. So I'm going to bring you back in a few... Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do first. Yeah, let, let's sort this out at the very least right now. Stick that on the trailer. Uh, oh, that is, yeah, I also would like to see if the... Um, He forgetting its name. Swaffer. <laughs> That's the one. You know, is this? Yes, it is. Yeah, that. This is true. A telehandler. I'm not sure a telehandler could truthfully in real life. Although I suppose if it's got, uh, yeah, the one and a half ton weight on top of its standard weight, it may just about manage it. Let's lift it a little higher. I do like this. I, I do find this very realistic when you're side loading because it is probably the way things would be done in real life or either that or if you were lucky enough to have a ramp maybe that as well oh i got yeah i forget when well, you've got follow me on the do all of the uh, oh wrong one always do that right. oh yeah so, yeah actually can we yeah we can let's just put a couple on for now i'm not sure this can pull that it should be it's an islet it is Yes, it is. It's, yeah, it's a funny trailer, though. Sometimes it works with some things, and then other things where it's plainly got that kind of thing, it doesn't work with things that have got that. I've not forgotten we've got some stones up there as well. We're going to stick that. Yeah, I've been thinking. I, I think I made mention that I thought we were probably at our limit with productions. I think we may add one more, truthfully. Yes, I was thinking about streamlining this and what would go well with this Let's Play. But I was trying to do the bunker silo and all the rest. But that, like any business, it's really about streamlining the business. So although as a farmer you would do that, yeah, when you're starting to go into productions, at that point you streamline and you you're making productions factories let's give it a, yeah fa productions is so fs22 isn't it let's go real life if you were investing in factories to make processors then you really would streamline it so if you found a better way and you've got 457,611 pounds in the bank well you probably would want to streamline things you really would so that things were uh, spot on to make things easy for yourself so uh, yeah I've given it some thought I think I may bring in an old friend yes definitely nothing that's going to unbalance everything as I keep saying that balance is important otherwise things can get silly we are earning a lot of money but then we are doing a lot of work as well and it is all legitimate things with legitimate mods without anything going too silly anyway I'm going to shut up because it's going to rain in a bit and I want to get this work done quickly so that we can scoot on at least we did the, uh, the biggest and most important thing is that we've done this now Marty said something that was rather intriguing it, if you um, if you use a plow it doesn't weed now that I let me just have a look I'll, I'll show you what I'm thinking because on silver run we have ploughed the field, and I looked on that earlier. I did a little bit of work on silver on because I was tweaking some things, um, and I noticed that although I ploughed, but I'm going to check to see if the plough that we've got in the game is a plough or whether it is a yeah, like a. Um, I should show you. Let's have a look. We have got one of the biggest. Ah, yes. Yeah, so there's all those other things that are ploughs, but not ploughs, aren't there? That I should show you what we've got. It may be that if you don't... No, it's not one of those either. Oh, I was forgetting. That's the one bad thing about this. This is now done by uh, alphabetical order, which, which before you at least... The one thing that was good was you had plows with plows. Uh, as in, like, yeah, the different types. Let's see it in this section. It Maybe it has to be a real plow for this to actually class as... Yeah, these are cultivators. Yeah. Cultivate, uh... Hang on, is it all oh, all plows that I've got then in plows and in power harrows? Is that it? I'm try I'm sure I'm missing some spaders as well, I know. But there's definitely... Yeah, the one that I've got is not showing. We have the one, one of the red ones. It's not one of the 6Ms or anything like that, or that one that I've had on one Let's... Is it that? No, it's not. No, it isn't. 
we did colour ourselves we've got the front one less I've not got it ticked on this let's go but I find that hard to believe it's not in spaders either <gasps> subsoilers ah, right so we know that this is it can be used instead of a plow so perhaps the subsoiler doesn't follow the same things because we've used a proper plow in the plow section on this and it is true to what Marty said but on when I've used the mat I don't know how you pronounce that I always say Mayag, that, yeah, the Cultivan 50. Is that the one we've actually got on that? Let's play. No, it isn't. It's red. It's a front. It's a front sort of... Yeah, it is, but it's not that either. I'm going to have to have a look and, and see what it is called, because we've got that, and I don't, obviously I don't think it is in the plow section or we would have seen that, so... Right, let's just quickly sort this out. I don't want this to take forever. Right, let's switch your own stuff. We'll do you later on. Yeah, I've had a few ideas. It's something that I, you, you all know that I'm a little unconventional. I try to do things that are, would be realistic because farmers are usually absolutely amazing at inventing things. They are the ones that have often invented these things that we see perfected by manufacturers. But they often did things a bit like we're doing with a... Um, the front box that you'd stick a uh, pump and pump some stuff in like we do with this type of thing that type of contraption is fully well what farmers have made over the years this cobbled together sort of design is what started off to make things like this although yeah this this does not I'm seriously considering even if I don't get much money of like selling the Amazon and getting another fertilizer spreader because again it does that weird thing sometimes where it throws it off and it looks so unrealistic really does right anyway yes I'm gonna just cut the cameras for a minute I'm gonna get all of the courses and we're not gonna no I'm not gonna do a, a time-lapse not for this one field it just seemed we're gonna set one we're going to do the liming because that thing we've got to or otherwise it will crash and burn and we shall set that going because it seems to be okay until it finishes at which point it ejects it onto the ground which is very bizarre yeah, so I, I am going to work actually did it bring me back was in, when I tried minutes. to grab this on the swaffer it didn't grab the thing and I thought well why has it got a connector at the back and yeah, this is doing a bit of a jig and the swaffer has been out for a while perhaps I've got this the wrong way around but it is sort of partially locking it's not in the right place but it is on sort of it might, yeah it may well drop off as I've said, just, just said that very thing oh oh wow <laughs> it's doing a jig is it sorting itself out uh, is that realistic I have no idea yes we shall oh can we no I think we may have to try and pull that off uh, obviously I think I've got that the wrong way around yeah we should sort that uh, off camera I've got these ready this one I'm gonna do myself this one I'm gonna set going now so let's set that going let's just check that it is actually now then uh, hang on one second did I oh, no, okay no that is not let's, let's just reload that 10 14 I created it clear load activate it is very high. I did this. Oh, I know. Have I, did I stop this before that had finished? I bet I did. Right, okay. In that case, oh, we can tell by looking in front. Yeah, nothing. Right, I did. Yeah. Right, well, in that case, I've got to be very careful. Do we time lapse this? Because it's going to take a few minutes. And nearest go. Well, that means I've got to go down the bottom. We've got a headland. Oh, do we... Yeah, this is going to be awkward now, isn't it? Right, I tell you what, I'm going to bring you back in a few minutes when that's finished its business because that's, that's, that's thrown a whole new thing. I'd forgotten I'd done this. Yeah, it was, it was getting, I'd say, late, but it was more like early. <laughs> but, yeah, we'll let that finish. All I should have done was actually just looked on this. It would have been an awful... Yes, that, that's much better, definitely. Right, well actually I think we could probably do the liming on camera. Definitely. So let's let's at least get this sorted. Yeah, now this is gonna struggle a little bit, I would say. Yeah. 
needs to build up a bit of speed. You can see the slant on this. And we're on auto. Should just about get this bottom bit. And that should be showing seeds. Oh, hang on one minute. Why not scan this field? No, that's not, not what I meant to do. No, I haven't. No, that explains a lot. Right, well, in that case, I really shall bring you back a few minutes because it'll be a total waste of time us doing any fertilising or liming until we've actually scanned the field. So I am going to go and get the bear and I'll bring that in. That will at least give us time for the seeder to crack on seeding. And I shall see you right. very so shortly. shortly. Let's get this scanned and then we'll get cracking. But we're not going to do anything with that. But it is bigger field than you think as well. Yeah, because this has quite got a decent scan area. And it's not able to get the full width of the field. So that just goes to show just how big this is. Yeah, it's much bigger than it fit. I did know it was a big field, but yeah. Nicely, it could take another two or three minutes. We'll get this top lined and maybe fertilized. I do love this scanner, it's amazing. And I love the fact that you get that bit of a slowdown with a real one where it sort of like sticks in the ground for a few seconds, whereas this is a modified scanner. Yeah. With a few little bits that make it a little bit, it's got a bit of better, bit of bit of a better range, and you can do a few things that the other one can't. But I didn't want it to be totally unrealistic. Oh, that is a point. Yes, I do indeed want to send that back to there. That shouldn't take too long, but it was four or five, so it's not perfect. Right, okay, let, well we've got a minute, let's see if we can grab that, let's let go of you for one minute and yeah, let's just see if we can push that around and see if we can get it locked properly, if not I'm not going to waste too much time, but yeah, it would be nice. just wanted to finish this uh, particular session off, I did, I, I didn't want it to be too big, but I would imagine probably by the time we finished it's going to be, yeah, an hour and a half job. Right, so... Let's try and pull that down because it is going to do the shaky wakey bits, isn't it? So let's try and grab it more in the middle and then we need to go around the other side. Ooh, we have action. Okay. You know, so I'm just trying to work out how you would know which was the right or the wrong way. Because to me it looks identical both ways, which to me would indicate that it's not. Now, obviously the middle bit is the bit where, which I thought, if that is right, then so that really should have locked. If it's got that locking scripty type thing, then it should just lock itself. But that doesn't appear to be locking. Let's see, has it got straps? It has. Right. Well, now that explains a lot. That was just a hunch. I just thought, well, if it's not got a proper locking script, has it got straps? And the answer to that question is, indeed it has. So there you go. Straps on that. I love it when you find out about mods. I say, I think we'll be definitely over the uh, coming Let's Plays be using the Swaffer. It really is fantastic. I, I'm very much fell in love with it the second I started to use it. So a great potential switch you off, we'll get you off off camera likewise with you and I would imagine you're not far off, I think probably yeah, one more by the look of that I would say we're going to grab the liming and we're going to do that yes you can see the potential for this though right, this is going to take a while to build but let's get this so. Yeah, I wasn't sure which 
which way they were going to go. So, right, we're definitely in the auto because that is going green. Ooh, yeah, I knew we'd be struggling a little bit with that. It should auto fill, I think, if I remember rightly. But that doesn't look like it is. Yeah, it's going to start to do that thing at the front where you need to drop the Joskin down low so it sort of like scoots just above the ground to give it a low centre of gravity so that it doesn't fly the back in the air. Right, I don't think that's too bad. Ooh, this field is bigger than I thought. I think we'll need it. I was, I was in my head, I thought we might have enough, but I don't think we will. I'm almost 100% convinced. Wow, is that yellow? That always does. Yeah, I would say 30 to 40 tons of lime for this. Brilliant. Well, at least we've got the uh, field sewn. That's one job. Very. But I am happy that that's done. Right, now we can set the fertilizer spreader going as well. Let's stop you there. Let's get you off the field. Wow, I did use quite a lot of uh, seeds. That just goes to show how large the field is, definitely. I'm going to set the fertilizer spreader going. I will grab those, but yeah, it's not top priority. This is obviously much more important is getting everything off the field and getting these two jobs done so that we can end this session. Right, so first. And are you on auto? That's what I want to know. No, you're not. Now you are. Right, even though course play seems to do its... Don't want that at all. And go. Oh. Why does it sometimes do that and other times not? Let's not look. Do you know? Yeah, and that, that really is why I'm very... I, I think that that is just proves my point. I, I aim for realism and that really isn't realistic. It really isn't. And whether you're using standard workers or whether you're using course play, it really isn't good enough for doing that. It really totally spoils the immersion. So I think we will be getting... I'm going to keep the, uh, the trailer though, because that I might get some backs for it. Uh, yeah, it's just that that is totally ridiculous. I can't remember. I think it pulls it up again and then uses it and then puts it down at the end. I don't know what, what that is about, but yeah, I do truly think that's what it does. When I run out, uh, are we going to ask the shop to drop some off? I always said that in the middle of a session when he's doing that. And I know we've got some across the road, but it's more about keeping the, the session going than anything else. Now this should. Mind you, I don't know that was on auto at that point, so it may well overwrite that to make that go solid green. I'm trying to think how much we're going to need. I would say another three or four bits. Is a point we have. Let me just try and grab that because that should. Yeah. Oh, so what? Ah, so it really was working because 821 was what it said it had got. So that's brilliant, right? Let's let's ask the shop to drop some lime off rather than us, yeah, totally ruin this. Oh, we need to dart off from the field and yeah, do perhaps I would say three. And then let's reset that straight away. And then we need to drop the back off. Grab one of those. No, actually I think we'll we'll leave yeah, this is the only trouble with things like this. You can't guarantee that it will leave. Right, I need to drop that down. I've been practicing a little. I can get got this wrong the other day. I'm not sure if that's got gonna get the hook. I think it needs to be proper, or it is actually the facing the eyelet, which I like. It's realistic. Even if it's a pain. Ooh. Should avoid us just trying to. Ah, 
You know, this is why you do need to drop this off. Because what you need to do now, if we hit refill truck, it's going to refill from that. So we need to be dropping that off and picking that up when we filled everything up. That is right. No, it's not. I need to be on the whole that. Ooh. Yeah, you didn't think that through very well, did you? No, I don't think I did either. <laughs> do you know? Oh, best laid plans are my cement. It probably would do exactly that as well, as I'm always going on about physics being such a beautiful thing, and it really is. But yeah, there are times when it isn't. Yeah, when you don't think about the consequences of your action. Yeah, I'm not sure how we're going to get out of that one. We might just manage without doing that. I think we might just leave it and just like pull up to it. And I should grab it off camera. Yeah, I don't want it don't to become a drama. We're fixing some major drama because of something like that. Let's just grab that all back. And yeah. How much more? I think, yeah, I, I reckon. Ooh, still struggling. Weight wise, it's not, it is, I don't think it's the Joskin either. It's sort of, I don't know, it might be, maybe it, maybe it does have a bit of a drag coefficient. I think the red just touches the ground. Right, okay. That shouldn't be too long doing that, right? We're going to get stuck in. Oh no! I was going to say do a time. I said we really no. It's it's not going to take very long. It's more the filling and that that's taking the time, and also the fact that I'd forgotten just how hungry the pH is when it's this yellow. When well, it's never been done. But once you've of course done it a little bit, it really is completely different. But yeah, to begin with, it really is terrible. I think it's only just over one full sort of thing. So. Let's have a look and see. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Right, so that would imagine the fertilizer thing is going to be chasing me shortly. Yeah, so what we'll do is it, it'll probably have a little bit of fertilizer still in, but I, I'm just going to sell it. Make a, uh, Yeah, it's more about getting rid of it than anything and get another one. Not sure. Oh, we've got the bread all now, haven't we? I am being silly. Yeah, we're doing this contraption. We've got the bread all across the road. I'd forgotten. It's it's amazing when you've not played with something on Alexa, but I remember it now. I've seen it in the background. So, yes, I've been silly. We could have easily managed. And it's the big bread all, if I remember rightly. So, we really didn't need to do any of this. <laughs> we didn't need to. Oh, although I've got to be honest, I do like. Not, not that. I don't like that, I might say. But let's that down because that is really getting silly now yeah you can see the odd stone that's where I made that mistake of uh, having the stone to go after I'd done the planter yeah it wasn't quite how I want it to be but it wasn't terrible so yeah we got most of it and that's what really matters brilliant okay so that's the fertilizer done I think we should just about do this, I reckon. Yeah, there's, a, there's looks like about one one row of that. Yeah. Yeah, thoroughly enjoying this, I really am. It's, it's getting somewhere now, and it's not taken us an awful long time to actually get to where we've got to. I'm really pleased with our pro Oh, I know we did, we did, yeah, I suppose it's true. Credit where credit's due. We have done a lot of work on the map. I mean, we didn't, we were not uh, shrinking days is where putting in the hours were concerned, like doing all the bales and the silage and the digestate and then the fertilizer business. So, yeah. And the wool, I mean, let's be honest, I mean, that was 350 odd thousand and a little bit more, yeah, with, with the bonus that you get for doing that as well. So, there we were done, finally. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, so I do. That's the point. Let's see if we can grab that from that bag and fill completely with that. Uh, I still don't think it's going to take eight tons, though. Just wondered if we took the weight from it, whether that would actually settle down to its natural position or whether we need to get something like the. Um, 
we have got the, yeah we have got the wheel loader just next door if it's just more than that Whoa. do you love the way the bags shrink that is a very nice touch I still don't think it's quite going to be enough to grab 8 tons that's 3.6, 4.6, 5.6, 6 point something so yeah there's still going to be some in that so I think we're going to have to grab it with the the big bag handler yeah that's as much oh my god that should who, ah, be the front box won't it I think it's the Joskin that's not quite wow it's wanting to push me because of the hill to really fight it I mean really fight it as well yeah it's just the Joskin but it's not a lot right let's just get out of the way Yeah, sort of same. But I'm going to do this off camera. Yeah, I'm going to say my words. We've done what we achieved, what we wanted to achieve, and we even scanned the field, which I'd forgotten that we'd not got to do. So, oh, ah, that's right. That's why we did choose 10, wasn't it? I did say this. It was a really nice field with a really good bonus. So I think we're at, at where I want to be field wise. I truthfully, wow, we got into 74 a bit with that scan. Yeah, I mean, look at the fields that we've got. I mean, 31 is the worst that we've got. We've got that little... Oh, that's a point. We haven't scanned two. Yeah, we are. We're going to, for once, we're going to do that because we know it's a good field. Yeah, there we go. So that's all fields on all data on all fields got. And, yeah, we've got that. That's, yeah, a bit of a mixed bag, but it's still very good. So I think that is, this is exactly where we want to be. I don't think we're going to go any more than that. I think we've got everything. I, yeah, I was I mentioned and then some a disaster happened. Yes, I'm going to try something different. Yeah, I was going to go belts um, for grabbing the potatoes, um, but I'm going to try something different actually. Maybe a combination, maybe belts as well, but something different to round the potatoes up. Yeah, that I've not seen anybody else do, but that doesn't mean to say that no one else has done it. Sometimes you don't always see things as a content creator because you're busy curating content yourself, and you haven't got time to look at all the content creators' work. So yeah, you, you don't always know. I do obviously watch some um, my favourites, truthfully. And I, yeah, DJ Gohan for the news, Mr. CDP um, when I get time. Uh, Frithgar, I haven't watched Frithgar in a, a, a while because again, you creating your own content so you've not got time it's not because you don't want to I would I'd be watching Fruith Gars and Miss Cinepies avidly if I weren't creating content myself anyway yes it's gonna rain a little while yeah I'm gonna say thank you very much for watching any comments as always yeah but I think we've got all the prep that we've got to be done yeah I, I will that production I should probably bring that in next session we still spending a lot of money as quickly yeah we are I mean we're certainly going down but yeah, yeah. Anyway, I, I, yeah, we should we should chat next session. Truthfully, yes. Yeah. So I'm gonna say goodbye for now. <laughs>